30. The clock is ticking for high school for JCPS seniors with graduation days now just days away. Many are finalizing their plans for what's going to come next. And thank you for staying with us at 530. I'm Doug Profit. And I'm Shay McAllister. This year they have a new option through the state's Everybody Counts program. Governor Bashir first announced Everybody Counts in November of last year. The program aims to provide every JCPS senior with either a job, post-secondary education, or both. The state partnered with Ford, GE Appliances, UPS, and Kroger for job opportunities. And today, Grace McKenna spoke with a student who secured her path with both a job and college. She tells us why educators say Everybody Counts will become a key resource for schools. It's all about options, providing students with different opportunities and different possibilities for what their lives look like after graduation. Sarah Abel is saying goodbye to another group of Fern Creek High School seniors. Our job as educators is to make sure that our students are prepared for life after high school. This year, though, she's sending them off with a new tool to build a better future. I mean, there's stuff to do after, but it's like now you don't have school anymore and it's like now what do we do next? Trinity Ritchie is one of the first students to participate in Everybody Counts, the state's new program announced late last year to connect students with post-grad jobs. I like working and making my own money and I also see every day that my mom works hard so I want to be just like her. Ritchie will go to class at JCTC and work in operations at GE Appliances. Katina Whitlock says Everybody Counts opened up a new pipeline of career ready candidates. I think they're curious. And so as a manufacturing company, that's what we're looking for. So we know that there's so many opportunities. GE has hired 16 seniors with another 17 more signing on soon. Kids are really aware of the just the job aspect of it, making sure that they do have um, job opportunities waiting for them. Abel said students are enthusiastic about the program after the pandemic focused on crafting a solid foundation. We know that we've prepared these students as best as we can and so we're excited to see what their future holds. As seniors like Richie wrap up their final days, Abel looks forward to watching them launch. Some of the numbers are still fluctuating here. The companies are still making some of those everybody counts hires as kids prepare to graduate in the next couple of weeks. In Fern Creek, Grace McKenna, WHAS 11 on your side.